This is the Iron Traders. The pits is closed here about a half hour ago, so we're going to take a look here at crude oil and natural gas. At the end of the video, the support and resistance levels will be posted. This video is for information purposes only and not a recommendation to buy, sell a stock commodity ETF. Please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. All right, here we have the crude. Now, this is a just a daily chart uh, on a yearly basis. But what I want to show you is here is the key support levels that are coming across. So when we look here at um, a longer view, okay, we had a really, really uh, rocket in top here, 123.68, came all the way down, and then right here, double top, went a lower high. Then we had some really nice sideways, great trading action. But now look at this really good key support that is going on right there. So what we want to do is we want to look at this support level. So that would be this candle right here. This is sitting at 72.25, okay, which lines up pretty good with the uh, monthly 200-day SMA, which is basically 72.72. So this, these are very, very key support levels. See how it's holding here? It's holding here all the way across. Now, again, if that is lost, then we go down to the next uh, uh, level here, which would basically be you know right down about the 70 area. So that goes all the way across like that, which is the, basically the bottom of these candles here. But this is what I want to show you uh, right there about this, how nice this support that this uh, sideways trading uh, did. Okay, now here we have the old daily, the weekly, and your monthly chart. So let's take a look here. All right, so what we want to do here is we want to look here at this, this area right here. So what it did, it came down and then it went, rose back up. But this is a, just a bare flag. And what happened again? Sold back down, went right back up, sold right off. Another bare flag. So we have to see what's going to happen here after this candle. Because if, if you look at it, it could not get through this uh, a key 100 SMA and this key uh, 8 SMA and actually close above. That is the key, is the close above. So let's tell you what, let's look here now at your support levels here. So we want to look here at this one here. This is your 8 SMA here. Okay, this is sitting at 75.62. So now the price is uh, above it. Okay, so if that is lost, then we want to look here at the top of this candle here. This is 75.28. And then we want to look at this candle. This is Friday's low at 73. 93. That's going to be good support level. Then we can go to these candles right here. Uh, you're looking at uh, 7377, and then you look in here at uh, 7261, and then 7219. Uh, the key level here is going to be this 200 SMA here on your monthly chart. That's 7272. That's very, very key uh, uh, level. So let's look at the upside. So what we want to do is we want to look at this 21 right here. See, at 77 flat, but it's starting to curve up, but it needs to close above. But we also have this 50 SMA here at 7606. You have this 100 at 7671 and this key 8 SMA. See how that rolled over? 7656. So when it comes down, it carries the price up, but when she rolls, then the price is very hard to get through. Now, if it can close above this uh, 100 SMA, then we have a nice target here at 79.10. That's your 21 SMA here. And then you have 82.19. Uh, and then you have your big retest there at 83.53. Uh, if it can go higher, uh, very, very strong resistance. Then you also have uh, 86.16 up there. And then 86.32 is your 50-day. Your but you can see how this is rolling over here. So bottom line, just watch this key right there, 73.93. That was Friday's low. And then watch this uh, key 8 SMA here and the 100 SMA. Now, tomorrow, after the close, you have at 4.30, you have the API numbers. And then on Wednesday, you have the EIA numbers. So uh, we'll have to see how that goes. Now, remember, OPEC started cutting uh, their supply by 1 million barrels uh, a day starting today uh, going into summer driving season. So don't expect oil to be sitting down here this low. So this is a good opportunity to scalp right now. And then if we can get above these levels, then we can go long. And if you get it close above this um, 83.53, then you can go flamethrower long because then she's going to go a lot higher. All right, here we have the old Natty Gas. Now, what we want to do is we want to look at the support level. 
levels, okay? So what we wanna do is we wanna look here at this uh, uh, key eight SMA right here, okay? This is sitting at 2.284. And then we wanna look at this eight SMA sitting at 2.22. And then we wanna look at the key level here, which is 2.20, that is your 21. If that is lost, then 1.946 is a target which can retest very, very easily. So we look at these price channels here, on the upside, 2.529, that was Friday's high. Now a close above, then we look to this candle right here, sitting at uh, 3.027, then we can look over here at 2.973, then we look at the 100, 3.175, and then your big boy, 200 SMA, sitting at 3.75. That would be the big upside target. But right now you have a good basing pattern here, uh, it's going to need a catalyst to, to, to break out, but you're coming into summer. If you have a hot summer, uh, natty gas could rally very, 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 very hard. Remember, when this thing rolls, they don't call this a widow maker for nothing. She can roll both ways up and down. So basically, watch these key levels here, especially 2.529. Uh, uh, that was Friday's high, and watch this key 1.946. All right. Thanks for watching.